Guys, what's up and welcome to another episode. For those of you that don't know me, I am Shane Farmer and this is Dark Horse Rowing. Guys, today we are rowing anywhere and today just happens to be Lululemon in Boulder, Colorado where we've been filming all week. So we thought, why not, let's ski in a, in a new location. <laughs> we decided to pop in to the Lululemon here in Boulder for the day and we've been doing clinics and skiing all afternoon with people and we've been putting people to the test. So this week's workout, because always we give you a workout with this video, is going to be a 100 meter ski sprint. I got a 17.8 seconds, that's your time to beat. Go do it, go have fun. Guys, we're gonna give you some exposure here at Lulu and we're gonna go have some fun. So we have Coach Jane Erbacher here from Melbourne, Australia, um, the ski coach, and I'm learning from her. But as we are out here, we're just hanging out. She's been teaching me a little bit of the uh, technique. Yeah, I know we've brought you guys content before about the skier, um, and we're gonna evolve that even further through Jane, and it's super exciting that we get to do this. I'm gonna give you a little sneak peek. She's going right now. Say a difference? Do you kind of do like a jumping thing? I do. She's passing it off to somebody else. We've been out here coaching all day and having a great time and uh, making sure that people are taking better strokes, learning everything they can about this machine. We are going to be the first to bring you guys content about how to use this machine consistently and how to enjoy your time on the machine. Oh, that'd be a blast. That would be awesome. I've just, I've just been challenged to a bodybuilding workout. I was like, did he just peek that? Chest and tries. Oh, yes. Yes, I love tries. So, guys, this is Xander, what's your last name? Um, Xander Vlastos. Guys, Xander Vlastos? Vlastos. Vlastos. <laughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> So guys, he has been helping us out. Uh, former gymnast also has been trying to get us to a local parkour gym. Um, unfortunately, we're out of time. Otherwise, we'd probably ski inappropriately at <laughs> a parkour gym. We just got done coaching with him. Uh, how was that, learning uh, from Jane? It, learning from Jane was amazing. I had never done this before, and it was just, it was really, it was an experience, yeah. Oh, <laughs> sorry. But it was awesome. Um, I would never done it before, and now I'm gonna have to get into a gym and find one. Yeah, hell yeah. Where do you think you can find one? Actually, no, because the other guy who you were hanging out with, Yeah. There's one at the CU Rex. Another guy that we were coaching and working with. Yeah. yeah. Glad you liked it, man. It was awesome. Thank you. <laughs> so what's happening with you with your hands is you're coming down and then you're kind of bringing them up in together, okay? So posturally, it means that you're rounding through your shoulders on the way up, but also the way that the machine actually works to bring your hands in is then creating inefficiency in the cable. Your handles want to go home. They basically want to stay in line with where they belong, which is on top of the pulley. And because of your height, your home is going to be about there, and that's actually totally fine though. Any people in a trip? Shane, you're gonna have to do it again. <laughs> Even better. It's a machine. 16.8. I think. I can check the memory on that. Yeah, true 16.8. You can see it though, his first three after that. Like yeah. Five, six, right? <laughs> All right. New time to beat 100 meters. 16.8. Come and get me. So we just had uh, a group of guys come hang out with us and uh, we actually had a cow rower join in. Say hi Channing. Hey, <laughs> uh, and for the record, I beat him on the 100. <laughs> oh, I'm just saying, I mean his 2k score is way lower than mine. Jane, 
what are you gonna do? Okay, so I'm gonna see how fast I can do 100 meters like this, one arm <laughs> at a time. Let's see what happens. <laughs> how does that go you again? Like the wait, show, music. wait, show me how it goes again. <laughs> All right, hold on, hold on, we got 100 on the screen. Imagine if I She's do ready to go. Yeah. Here goes Jane Erbacher, queen <laughs> of skier, oh. going. <laughs> I got 176 strokes and oh, it says double pole to calibrate. It's not a free, it's not counting. Is it going? No. <laughs> I guess it's not. Oh, it was. Okay, now go. <laughs> go. <laughs> go, Jay. I'm going to like 3. 25.3. 25. 25. <laughs> I tell you what, my <laughs> triceps. Yeah, that was surprisingly oh, entertaining. I think we can agree that's probably not the most efficient technique. <laughs>